Yo and hello, happy Saturday everybody, Mike here, Baseball Collector. I've got six slabs that I've got in the mail over the last couple of days, and I'm going to start showing those off. Let me put one up just so you can look at it instead of just listening to me. Um, quite frankly, I've had a really hard time lately finding or buying cards on eBay, at least slab vintage, because the prices to me have just gone so high that I have a really hard time justifying it, and there's just not, honestly, there's just not a lot of good deals to be had, so I have been really patient and just biding my time. I hope things get a little bit better, or I just acquiesce and end up buying them, but for now, it's been very slow going on the, you know, slab, vint vintage slab front, and that's okay. Uh, our collections kind of shift over time, and we focus, and then change our focus and been doing a lot of autographs lately and things so it just kind of moves around a little bit and uh, but for now let me show you what I did get this is an 85 top stickers the bunch of these were from five of the six were from four sharp corners and sometimes when you buy cards you just go oops uh, like this one I already had this one in an eight so I didn't even realize it or remember and so now I have two of them, but uh, I got it so cheap it was like six bucks or something. So it wasn't wasn't crazy expensive, but still no fun to buy a card twice. Next up, this card. The rest of them I did not have. Uh, this one here, can't believe I didn't have an '81 Topps Nolan Ryan, but I did not. But I do now in a near mint to mint eight for my Nolan Ryan Master Collection and my three decade set. So love it. That was the first Nolan Ryan card. Uh, of him on the Astros. Here's another 81 tops. This is a record breaker of Johnny Bench. Most home runs for a catcher lifetime. I think that has since been broken by Mike Piazza, but he was the record holder for a long time. Very neat. Here is a 1979 tops Reds team card. So shout out to JY Sports Card Guy and trying to think who else are red fans but sparky anderson is pictured here as the manager he's a hall of famer so this is part of the three decades set the next up is phil necro 1977 tops in that classic braves jersey with the lowercase a or script a i guess and a near mint eight new lighthouse holder very pretty card and then my most vintage card I would say that I got here is this 68 tops Jim Catfish Hunter with the A's I love the 68 tops design it's really grown on me over the over the years and this is an excellent mint six <coughs> it's interesting because usually if the name on the card says Jim Hunter the slab will say Jim Hunter whatever it says on the card is typically what they'll put on the name on this on the flip and it's interesting that in this case, they, the name is Jim Hunter, but on the card flip, it's Catfish Hunter. So very interesting. But uh, there you go. Excellent mint six on that. So quick and easy mail day. That's what I got. Uh, hope you enjoyed it. Haven't shown some slabs off in a little while. So glad to finally get a few more and keep the beast fed. The beast has to be fed. It gets angry. It gets hangry when it's mad and hungry. So thanks guys for watching. Have a great weekend and keep collecting.